This is an unboxing first impression of my Kyber lightsaber that I just received. You can see the box, now you can't. Uh, so I'm just going to open it up. Uh, nice sturdy box. I've had mine for about a day now, just kind of getting a feel for it, things like that. Everything came really nicely packaged, uh, nice protective, just kind of foam on top, little card telling you what everything is. Um, I was lucky I didn't have any problems with any missing pieces. Apparently, that happened to a few people. I didn't have that problem at all. Um, I actually took the saber out already and changed it to my perfect configuration, which is this red dwarf cross guard piece, red sleeve, and hard and heavy pommel at the bottom um, with a red light. That's, that's what I like. Um, and basically, I just, I really like it. It's, uh, it's nice and heavy. It's heavier than I thought it would be, which is what I wanted. Um, I'm a bigger guy. I have enough strength to swing it around. It's a little heavy for my girlfriend, but, uh, she'll get used to it. And she's probably gonna, I bought two with the Grand Master Pack, so she's gonna, you know, configure it with a little bit lighter pieces, probably. Um... You can see I have all the uh, attachments right here, such accessories, um, and I got the second box with all the extra pieces um, right here. Also, well packaged. Now I've already taken everything out of the out of its uh, packaging for that would protect it. Probably not the smartest idea, but I was so excited when I got it. Um, really love this piece too. Just great claw. Um, so, like I said, I've been playing around with it for about a day now. Uh, positives. Nice, heavy, sturdy construction. Uh, swap out pieces are pretty easy. Uh, color is bright. I, I've never had a lightsaber to compare it to before. Except for cheap, uh, you know, Target and Walmart lightsabers. Um... So I, I can't really speak to that comparatively, but it's bright to me. The 20 changing colors is just great. Uh, I really love that. Um, Cause I, I don't want to just be stuck with dark side or light side when I pay that much for a saber. Um, and negatives, uh, a few of the pieces are a little sharp. I, I'm, for example, here on the bottom, these tips are a bit sharp, but that's, I, I think that's avoidable, especially if you're using gloves or anything, like they provide it with the Kickstarter. Um, and the noise is good, but it could probably be improved by having customizable sound options. Right now it's a little basic compared to some of the things I've seen. I mean, I'll turn it on again, you can hear turn on sound move sound that <laughs> flash on clash has a good noise for that um, and uh, turn off sound um, the sound can get a little uh, obnoxious if you're just swinging it around for the light and stuff but I'm definitely not going to try and void my warranty by uh, removing that component on the inside um, but it's great uh, so far, I really love it, and, you know, I, I might just break this blade, and if so, uh, they promised the, one, the lifetime warranty, so I'm super excited about that. I'm not going to try and break the blade, but I could, just uh, acting stupid. So, yeah, mine came with a charge, um, so I was able to just start playing with it right away. Uh, I'm sure that two-hour waiting period, if I had had to, would have been kind of sad, but um, I like it. I like it a lot. And uh, at 250 through the Kickstarter for the lightsaber and 22 accessories, I was super excited.